Hey guys, welcome back to another how to video series for new international students. Today we will bring you a video about classroom expectations. Welcome to Glass Hall. This is one of the most recently renovated buildings on campus. It is the home to the College of Business, and here there are multiple resources available to our students, like study rooms, interview rooms that you can reserve, and even a balcony for when studying gets a little too overwhelming. All right, so we want to make sure you know what to expect when you come into your classroom. Sometimes, culturally, things can be a little different. For example, in Colombia, you would refer to your teacher as kind of like your friend. But here in the United States, it kind of depends. It kind of varies from professor to professor. Sometimes, your professor would like you to call him by his first name, sometimes by your last name, or doctor, whatever. So make sure you um, talk to them and make sure that they're comfortable with whatever you're, however you're speaking to them and referring to them. In China, for classroom behavior, I try to be very quiet in class and just take notes. But in the United States, the professor will encourage students to share their ideas and for critical thinking. Oh, we were just looking at this. Whenever you are registering for classes, make sure that you look at all of the options available for you. Sometimes there are se sections just available for international students, like COM 115, for example. COM 115 is public speaking. Sometimes you don't feel comfortable sharing your ideas and doing some public speaking in front of American students. So maybe you feel more comfortable with some international students. You can do that as well. But you can also go and do the regular class of public speaking, which is with American students, and maybe just get that experience. I thought it was really worth it when I did it. United States is very strict about academic integrity, and rules can be different with your home country. So make sure that all your sources are your assignments, and you can work. You can only work with your classmates if a professor has assigned a group project. Also, there are lots of opportunities for you to get hands-on experience outside of the classroom. You can go on field trips, you can do research work, and you can also go and do an internship. Make sure that you talk to your academic advisor to see what options are available to you. For academic advisors, they expect to meet you once a semester. If not, you may get a hold on your reg registration status. That means you are not able to register any classes in, in Missouri State. Hold up, hold up. Did he say get a hold? Yeah. If you don't know what that means, no worries. We've got you covered. There are different kinds of holds that will prevent you from registering for classes for your next semester. We mentioned the most common ones in different videos, but for a full list of them, please check the website. All right, that's it. Let's go back to the video. So, for example, if you are a student in College of Business, you should come here in the academic centers. You can email them or call them to make appointment with your advisors. And you have, you have to decide what classes to take, but work with them to make sure you are taking the right things for a program in Missouri State. When in doubt, ask questions. Policies vary from professor to professor or in different classes, so make sure you ask whatever is in your mind. Alright guys, that's all for this video. We'll see you on the next one.